any hash. Five dollars is the credit minimum. Come on. Use the ATM. How much is that? It's fine. Two sixty-five. Yeah, I can pay for it. Um, can I get a pack of cigarettes as well? Just some blues. Eighty. Uh, keep the change. You should take a first sip. I don't drink. You paid for it. Can I bum one of those? So do you live around here? Used to. Just moved here a couple weeks ago. Uh, cool. I never call your name. It's, uh, Ian. Amber. Strong handshake you got. Uh, I guess. Do you want to hang out by any chance? I love a tour from a local. I kind of have to be somewhere. Where? We're in one of the largest cities in the world. You can't find somebody else to show you around. You're right. I could. Living in? I would have hated the noise. I don't know. You, you kind of get used to it after a while. It's not too bad. Why'd you leave? Where'd you go? Ah, uh, Houston. I'm from Australia. Never would have guessed that one. How long are you here for? Just a, just a couple days. Do you have any plans? Uh, maybe, maybe Central Park, but I really think it's gonna rain today. That's it? You're telling me you decided to leave Texas with no plans and a backpack? It seems kind of irresponsible. And didn't you try and buy a beer at 11 a.m. on a Wednesday? So what's so special about Central Park? Uh, there are these rocks, uh, a little bit tucked away in the park. I used to go there when I was younger with my mom. Now, we didn't have a whole lot growing up, so uh, yeah, that was kind of our spot. I never really understood that. What do you mean? I don't know, it's just, just never really close with my parents like that. I know you're supposed to like look up to them or worship them or whatever. Just, their only job is just to mold you into a better version of themselves. I wouldn't have gotten married so young if it wasn't for them. You're married? Was. Is that really what you got from that? Uh, I mean, do you mind if I ask what happened? Sometimes things happen that change the way people look at each other. Let's leave. I'll get the check. You see that woman over there? 
<laughs> yeah? I wish I could be more like her. What do you mean? She just seems so free. Uh, Amber, she's... she's wasted. She's probably lost people. Made and betrayed friends. Fallen in love. And been so overwhelmingly heartbroken. But look at her. It's like... None of it even matters. Or she's just drunk in the park. Well, I guess it's up to the imagination. Well, I guess so. Why do you do that? Do what? Every time we start a conversation, you kill it. I don't... I don't mean to. Sorry. Did you not have many friends? Is it because you were too busy hanging out with your mom? Where are you going? Just do me a favor. Stop pretending we're not strangers. I don't really think we're strangers anymore. Amber, I don't even know your last name. It's Johnson. That's <laughs> not I'm going for a walk. Okay, let's go. No, I, I need some space. Ian. Enough. Don't. Please, just stay with the stuff. It's open. Hi. You know, you really shouldn't give your address out to just anybody. So you're gonna kill me now? Uh, no. 
gum is for me. Is that why you're here in the city? Yeah. I don't have to say. Can I ask why? How do you explain being so fucking sad and angry all the time when you've had an objectively good life? I've had an objectively good life, but uh, one day I just felt like I didn't. And I didn't know how to fix it. For a while, I really thought I was gonna grow out of it. I thought maybe medications would help too. the whole time it felt like no one really understood me and then my mom passed when I was young and my father is I'm sorry no, it's funny um, because I resent them both my mom for leaving me with him and my father for not being the one that died. But now I catch myself missing them. Because, uh, they, they're the ones that are supposed to be on my side. I've been alone for so long that I, I don't even know what it's like to feel wanted. Lose someone. I've just been running for so fucking long.